look, we're back. So we last left off. We had just turned off the alarm in the museum. And originally I was going to play a little bit uh, a little bit after this, do some spring cleaning of our inventory, because I had an epiphany on damage. But I wanted to show you guys a cutscene that happened, so I couldn't just do that. So we turned off the alarm. As soon as the game, there we go. We turned off the alarm. And then we get this cutscene. Remember how I said that you'd be hearing that singing a lot in this game? Yeah. Not sure where the, exactly that slam's coming from. It's, is it coming from the walls? Whatever. You get, like I said, you get three guesses what the boss was going to be in this. Of course it's a giant T-freaking-Rex. Why would it be anything else except a T-Rex? can't believe it so that's how she controls inanimate objects and of all things she's crazy so before we go a little bit further we're gonna see if we can leave and then come back because I really want to do some spring cleaning of my inventory because I really had an epiphany right honestly firing seven shots isn't really or firing multiple shots of any kind isn't really worth it right and if I have a handgun where I'm able to instantly and quickly get my AT up anyway it's better off just getting the one shot, going to the next attack, getting the next shot, going to the next attack, etc, etc. See, like here, I'm stuck in an animation where I can risk getting hit. Whereas if I just have a really powerful handgun, I can just shoot really strong once. Uh oh And there'll be less of that. Reloading. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go to... Ah... Uh, now, yeah, I think I'm just going to stick with a handgun and even lower my shots down even lower. What's my highest, strongest handgun right now? Is it this one or... It's this one. There we go. Dodge. One shot here, two shots here. Nighty night. Oh, you woke up instantly. shot, two shot. So yeah, what I'm going to do is, if I can, head back to the precinct and clean up my inventory quite a bit. I should be able to get down to the first floor now that the elevator is activated because the alarm's off. Should. Optimal word here is should. Come on. Three shots here. Please don't attack me. Thank you. Three more shots. Ooh, sweet. And with how fast my AT goes up anyway, it'd honestly be worth it just to be able to get less hit from hit stun because I'm reloading and crap. Uh, junk can't use that. It is a shame that you won't get to see the junk in this playthrough. Or how broken the uh, those guns are, but eh. And down to first floor. Thank you. Please let me go to the precinct. Thank you. I know there's a giant T-Rex on the loose, but me putting away my guns is more important, I promise. Oh god, it's gonna make me walk all the way over, isn't it? Yep. As I don't think this area, that little walkway right there is really necessary at this point, but whatever. Uh, precincts. I'm also going to dismantle that gun that we have like 30 points onto. 
because I really don't really care about doing multi-fire anymore. Because with how damage works, it isn't that... So, this gun has three shots. So it's not saying that it's doing... Well, you'll, you'll see soon. There's no reason to explain it when you'll, when you'll just see how it works sooner or later. Or pretty soon, actually. Let me in. Alright, first comes first. Get this ammo. Thank you. Second. Yeah, so I'd like to discard some junk. Oh, I don't have any. Um, Let me make sure what I'm going to keep. So I'm going to keep the handgun. I need to take a bolt out of a lot of these guns is what I need to do. Reload. No reason for any of these to have any amounts of bullets. You should have full bullets, though. There we go. Sweet. Okay, so we're going to store the gate key. Keep the warehouse key for right now. Because I might do that in a little bit. So we're going to keep both chest piece and we're going to keep the G23. Oh, interesting fun fact. All the... I'm not sure about some of these other guns. Well, I know some of the other guns. But for the most part, I know that every single handgun is based on an actual gun of some kind. Move this over. Boop. Take this. Take this. Take this. Take this as well. Take the machine gun. Take the grenade launcher. Keep the club. Store items. Take this cure P. I almost feel bad. Oh, I didn't drop it. Nice. Really? Alright. It's not going to let me discard it until I finish the zone. Good to know. I will move the tools over. There's no reason to have these cluttering my inventory while I'm just out and about. And... Alright. Bye. And now we can go clear out that area. Have everything in our inventory all at once. And I won't lose out on any items. There is one gun in particular I want to find. And hopefully I don't activate the next cutscene and force myself to fight the boss beforehand. If I can remember right where it was. I hope I don't mess up and miss it. Let's see, where are you? Ah, here. No, uh, no, not here. Um... Ah, there we go. Back to the museum. We're going to go up these stairs. Once again, they could have cut this out now that the security guard's not over here. The first time this is necessary, all the other times it is not. So slow going up these stairs. Uh. Ah, yeah, there's no reason for you to slowly walk towards the door. Oh, my lord. I believe the gun I'm looking for is on the third floor. Don't quote me on that. I hope I'm right. There's a lot of hoping going on right now. Swing over here. Third floor. Let's start off back where we were before. Oh, we can also get up to the fourth floor from right there. Uh, Lost Raptors and two Roly Poliolis. Ow. Stay away from me, please. Ow. I should be able to bleed, finish with this volley. Nope. So, one more shot here. And two shots there. Ah, too far away. Let's just fire three shots into it. Uh-oh, bad time to reload. Please don't touch me. I'm, re I'm firing at you. Leave me alone. Uh, I think you're going to walk towards me so I can get three shots off. Nice. One here, two here. 
Ow. Uh, let's just heal up. There's no reason for me not to with how efficiently you just get PE back while we dodge this. One, two, three. Ooh, you aborted the sleep. One, two. Medicine, three, and ammo. Feels really good to be able to put up, uh, pick up items again. What's up here? Might as well check up here before I go back down. Actually, I want to say that we can get... I believe that the gun that I'm looking for is to the left of... Hmm. I truly can't remember it. I'm going to save when I get to the telephone over there. Because I really do want this gun. Come on. Ah. Oh, of course. One, two, three. Another volley. Uh-oh. One, two. Medicine three. Where was this thing? This is the problem with playing a game a couple of times and not playing for a long while. You just do not remember things. To the left, to the left. I am walking to this path to the left. Back to the back room. What was in here? I put a medicine three in here? Yeah, I might as well pick it up now. Am I going the right way? I think I'm going the right way. I have lost the map. The, the orientation of this map in my head. Two, three. Take two more bullets in this shit. Ow. Kill it. Ah! Oh. One here, two here. Two here, one here. I got him in the... Not quite, not quite. I almost got him in a rotation. Two here, one here. Got him. They're done. Nighty night. Don't let whatever you are bite. Get it? Because they're bugs. Nope. Shot mid spin. I'm a suck. Is it up? Where was that back room? Was I in here before? Oh yeah, I was already here. Where is the back room though? Where was that room I was in before? Wasn't it this way? Oh my lord. Times like this I kinda wish you had the ability to run away. There probably is an ability to run away. I just don't know how. Ow. Please don't bite me. No, wait. Uh. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. You should be dead. Yep. Run away. There we go. Stay away from me. Own medicine. Let's use this medicine now, since we have plenty of medicine threes. Where'd this lead to? Oh, this was outside. Hmm. Maybe it was on floor four. I apologize for wasting everyone's time again. Hmm. Come uh, on, nope. Aww. I just want this gun. Nah, skip it. The gun we get from the next boss is just as good. Ow. If not better in some regards. So we're gonna head to floor four. Ow. Ow. I need to change my guns. Wait, no, 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 don't bite me! 
There we go. Three. Nope. Mm. More ammo. You can never have enough of that. Frogs. Wait, no. Wait, no, no, no. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Two volleys should kill it. Please stay away from me. Taking all this extra damage for no good reason. I really need to get that second gun. I deactivated the alarm, but it's not opening. I need a key for this one. So where was the pathway I went to last time? Look at me wasting a massive amount of time in this video. I swear I'm not padding. I'm honestly kind of lost. My geographical map in my head is throwing me off. I know I went to this elevator. What am I missing? No fight, no fight, no fight, no fight. Sweet. Was it this way? It might have been this way. Oh no, it was... Yeah, it was, and I dropped down. Yeah. I'm gonna try to take out the frog first. Nah, skip it. It's not that important. There's no reason to waste this much time looking for this gun. And like I said, the next boss gives me a pretty decent one anyway. Uh oh, that's on reload. Oh, okay, good time to reload, actually. Alright, you're done. I'll take this time using a Medicine 3 Sensor. Oh, that's a Medicine 2. Nah, I don't need to use a Medicine 3. Come on. So we dropped down to floor 2, but there's no reason to really look for it. I'm just gonna hit the floor 4 since we haven't been up there yet, and then I'm gonna go fight that boss. Sorry about that. Alright, floor four. What we got up here? We got all that bio slime and stuff all gunking everywhere. Oh, and a floor cover. Gross. I think I actually have to go back to floor two. And second floor. Yeah. Right? It was here? Because we dropped down a level from floor three? Yep, yep. Because I remember there's a shop. And there's an item in here. Oh, wait, nope. I already picked up the item from last time. Okay, I think I'm on the right path now. Because there was another path to the left that I wanted to go to. And before, this was a massive waste of time. It's probably going to be a massive waste of time. There's probably nothing even over here. Oh, oh. Hey, there is a pathway. I didn't just waste everyone's time. All right. Ooh, I see an item over there, too. I'm going to get bit here, though. Oh, no, I dodged it. Can I dodge this? Nope. Bit again, maybe. 
No. Yep. I can kill you, and then... Uh-oh. One shot here, two shots here. No, wait, 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 wait! Uh, you can clip me. Nice dodge. Bad time to reload, Aya. Thank you. More ammo. You never have enough of it. We will use another medicine too, because why not? What's in this box? Is this the gun I was looking for? No, it's just to revive. Equally as good. I'd activate the alarm, but it's still not opening. I need a key for this one. Can we go up from here? I think we gotta go upstairs to, uh, and then loop a rack around, I believe. But there's no reason not to check here. Especially... Oh, nope, we opened that one already. And make sure we also got this one. We did also get that one. So I believe we have to go upstairs here. Yes, it, by the way, yes, the T-Rex is on the first floor. But all the doors leading to it are currently locked. So we had to trigger, uh, trigger another cutscene in another area first. Uh, hmm. Question is, how do I get to there? Hmm. Ugh, another cutscene. Or another battle, I should say. Bang, bang. Bang, bang, bang. And you guys are... Oh, wait. No, wait. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Like, oh, oh, nice. You missed. You're just bad. One there, two here. One here, two here. I believe that should be one dead. Hey, you're stun locks. Full recover restores all HP and removes status. There are only three, maybe four more relevant levels in this game, and this that past that is just leveling up to max out your character. Or max out Aya, I should say. So I'm on the first floor now. Where is that cutscene trigger? Not in here. Oh, come on. Like I said, I do love this game. There's just some tiny nuanced things I wish I could do without, you know? But that's every game, right? There's no such thing as a perfect game. Every single game has its flaws and just little nitpicky problems with it. Can you stop? Can you stop? Nice. Cannot wait to get that gun I'm talking about, though. Uh-oh. See, that's not going to be a problem anymore when I get that new gun. And when I actually get an upgrade of the current gun I'm dealing with. Let's see... Where are you, giant T-Rex? Is it down? Nope. Need the key for this one. So the key to his room is locked. So I need to find an area to trigger the cutscene so I can actually go fight this thing. Now, where is it? I want to say it's on one of the upper floors. Somewhere on floor three, I want to say. The rainforest. Didn't know it's up there. That's neat. So is it floor three and I gotta go down? Or is it floor four is the question. Can I go this way? 
I can. Nah. I want to say it's maybe floor... I'm going to go to floor 3 and drop down one level and see if that can get the trigger there, maybe. Worst comes to worst, I just got to pan out through all the floors. Uh, let's try... 4-3. Medicine. Is it 4-3? Uh. More Velociraptors! Go away! I want to see how much my energy shot does. Damn. 319. Enough to full kill. And get stun locks. Wait, no, 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 I'm shooting. Uh, get away from me. Uh, there we go. No. No. That, let me take this time to get a cure three off. And then we light him up. Hey, easy. Open up. Can I not go out of here again? Okay, so it's not over here. Maybe it's one of these other staircases. Man, I am wasting a crap ton of time. And this is honestly not on purpose. I can literally just not remember the place I need to go to trigger the cutscene. To actually start the next area. Or the next boss fight. I can't remember if it's floor... Two, floor three. I just know it's not on the bottom floor. Go through window. No, I don't want to go back inside. Eh, let's forget it. Is it to the left here? Maybe. Is it? No. Just some bugs and some pterodactyls. Two, three. One, two, three. Please don't hit me. Dodge that. One. Oh, that's all I needed. Just one left. Okay. Dodge your attacks. One here. Two here. Good night. You've been stun locked. Or sleep locked? I don't know. This almost feels like cheating. Almost. Oh. Oh, come on, just die. There we go. Medicine 3 and ammo. Do this one yet? 25 million years ago, oxygen increased in the air. Why? Uh, Haley's comet dropped a meteor. Reaction between gas and H2O? I don't know. Is the photo says to this? Oh, yep. Nope. Need a key for this one, too. I can't remember where to go. I'm wasting everybody's time. I feel bad. Yes, go through the window here. No, I don't want to head back inside. Ah! So I can't head to the left at all. Let me just head straight to the right.
Can't I jump down? Really? Really? Come on. Where is this trigger? Alright, I'm going to be right back so I can figure out where this trigger is. Sorry about this, guys. This took longer than I was willing to admit. But I just remembered, after spending about an hour walking through this place trying to figure out where to go, I literally just remembered where I should go. Who has been locking me in rooms all this time? Dr. Clamp. Whose room do we now have access to? Dr. Clamp. There's someone in there. Ugh, that should have not taken me so long. I am smarter than that. Professor Clamp, don't move. Put your hands up in there where I can see him. I ain't a. <laughs> Hi, uh, yes, there's thing I really needed to test. Uh, man, put my arms down now. Oh, poor Maeda. You adorable, lovable little nerd. Did you come back here alone? Um, no. Daniel came with me part of the way. Well, where is he? Uh, yes, he went to look for something at the hospital. He should be on his way here. Oh. There haven't been any combustions recently, so I, er, uh, er, uh, anyway, I asked Wayne to make this back at the station. Please use it. What is it? Yes, er, uh, I'll have to explain later, but I believe this will have some effect against Eve and the creature she controls. Thank you. I guess I'll have to wait and see what it does. My head is gone. One damage, 60 range, 15 bullets. Yeah, I came across some findings. Hmm, yes. First of all, there was blood serums from Maya's name labeled in the freezer. My sister's name, and? Well, the research coded it was called Eve. Eve? Then Eve really is. It appears to have been made up of lizard cells. He was cultivating them in the past, or culturing them in the past. What do you mean? What for? I don't know. There isn't any data left. But it seems Dr. Clamp has been culturing them for years. Recently, it appears he was conducting research on artificial sperm. For Eve, of course. For Eve. Er, yes. He wanted to exclude the mitochondria from the sperm and create new sperm. Sperm with no parasites. Sperm with only the nucleus. Sperm without the mitochondria? Yes, he took the sperm that he created here and moved to the hospital. There, he would artificially inseminate those who would volunteer for the experiment. Then, what was the HLS? HLA list for then? That Professor Clamp! You ordinary beings will never, never comprehend my level of research. Professor, I'm placing you under arrest as the ringleader of this operation. What you did... This isn't something you can do. This isn't something you can get away with. Do you understand? Ha ha ha. You're pathetic, Brea. Why put yourself in the human domain by reciting meaningless laws? They're meaningless. Do you understand? Shoot him. Shoot him. Ha <laughs> ha. I guess you haven't told your little friend yet. Your mitochondria has special powers, doesn't it? Aya. Uh, shoot him. Ha <laughs> ha. But sadly, you still have not the form of a human being, don't you? Shoot him. But you can say all you want. But I'm here to arrest you, Dr. Clint, Professor Clint, whatever. But I'm not letting you interfere with Eve, you hear me? Do you understand? Aya, look out! Mmm, <laughs> that sucker punch. <laughs> that was a very unflattering face for Daniels, though. Daniel, thanks. I, I didn't see the scalpel. Just in time. Why didn't you shoot? You could have been killed! I know. It just didn't seem real. It felt more like, uh, shoot him now. He's conscious again. Shoot him now. This guy orchestrated the death of literal millions. Dallas to the rescue, eh? Officer Dallas, why didn't you shoot me? What? I know you hate me. What do you mean? What do you want to say, huh? Of course I hate you. Because of you, Lorraine's. Lorraine, hmm. But I see that your boy managed to escape. You. I should have killed you way back. Someday you're going to pay for this. Haha, <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. What are you planning to do, Professor? Oh, you'll love this. I'm waiting for the birth of the ultimate being. The mitochondria is passed on from the mother, but you see, traces from the father can also be found in minute quantities. According to Eve, her sister in Japan was unable to attain her ultimate goal because the father's side of the mitochondria caused a rebellion. For Eve to succeed this time, I created a sperm without the male mitochondria DNA. The creation was a success. Eve is now pregnant with Melissa's body. Pregnant? <laughs> How can this be possible? Damn, Aya, we gotta kill Eve. Let's go. Haha, <laughs> you humans are so weak, so stupid. Shoot him. You may have been able to barge in here and do things in your way until now, but things are going to change. I won't let you interfere with Eve anymore. Eve, can you hear me? 
You don't have to wait anymore. I'm ready. What the hell are you talking about? Daniel made it run. She's gonna blow up the whole place. Shoot him. So I see. Your mitochondria power doesn't allow you to burn. Why? Why stay here and try to save me? First of all, I'm a cop. It's my job. And after all, I am human. Shoot him. <laughs> like I said, humans are pathetic. Clamp key. Well, rip that guy. Where'd they go? Did they just like jump into the wall? Oh, uh, whatever. And now that we have the clamp key, we can finally go through those doors that we couldn't go before. Ugh. So we're gonna head for floor three now. Actually, better yet, we're gonna head for floor one. And we're gonna save really fast. And saving. There we go. And now we're gonna go to floor three and end all this. Still kind of convoluted that I had to go to floor three to get up to get to the floor one, but don't question it. This video game's fun. It's allowed to be dumb in some places. Okay. Oh, more enemies. Oh, right. And one thing I was able to do while I was searching around for the hour is I finally found a shotgun. In fact, that's what I'm holding in my hand right now. It works that it has a spread, so everything behind the cone will be attempted to be attacked. If they are in the cone, they both take the normal damage. And you can tell if you're targeting enemies based on the white glow. See, those two are glowing, I'm going to shoot both of them with the shotgun. And now that one's rolled in, so I shoot all of them with the shotgun. It's a very neat weapon uh, concept for just clearing out lots of enemies really fast. Because, you know, AoE attacks. Uh, angle myself here. And there we go. Bam. Bam. Yeah, but that's a shotgun. They all, every single shotgun in this game has burst. And generally, you only want to t take burst off a shotgun and put on something better, like a handgun. But now would be a good time to look at Maeda's gun. So... It's a gun with one power. What is this useful for? If you played an RPG before, you know how this works. But I might as well show it off anyway. Is it not this way? It's somewhere here. One of these locked doors. It's not here, is it? No. Because this is still blocked off by the goo. I believe it's all the way around. Don't quote me on that. And before I have to have another fight because I went the wrong way. Okay, good. I kind of want to have one more fight really quick just so I can show off Maeda's gun, but eh. If I don't, that's better anyway. Save some time in this video, which is already getting kind of long. Which is on me, and I apologize for not remembering which way to go. Come on. I still want to know where Daniels and Clamp went. <laughs> Just kind of jump through the wall like that. Use Clamp Key.
And here we are. Yep, straight up just a Triceratops. No introduction, just bam, Triceratops. This is a basic mini boss as well. But. So, is that one target? Yeah, just one. Bullets always do one damage with this thing because this only has an effect. Ow, that didn't even do damage to me. That was weird. On the final boss because, you know, it's your, it's your lore weapon. Uh, I'm going to dodge this attack or just take the damage. Two, three. Two, three. Come on. I can dodge. Or oh, I can't dodge that. I should be able to get one more volley off. Never mind. We are going to get a cure three, though. Heal three. Sorry. Come on. Come on. I'm going to throw a... No, I won't use haste. There's no reason to. Ow. At least the hit registered that time. I shouldn't do three shots here. I'm gonna get punished. Yep. Ow. Do you mind? Oh, it's getting faster. Which means it's taking damage. Bad time to reload, Aya. Two, three. Three more. I'm gonna dodge now. No, I won't. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, it's doing three now, which means it's even lower. Ow. We're going to use a gene heal, just to see how much it will heal me for. So I was at 126. Ow. 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 That was annoying. Oh, come on. Oh, that's a neat concept, though. Are you just going to spam electricity now that your head's gone? Yes, exactly what you're going to do. That's fine. But you're not charging me anymore. Oh, now you're just charging at random. Now you're just charging at random. I'm fairly sure this is how Triceratops work. Ow. Whatever. Three. One, two, three. Oh, my head fell off. I can just now explicitly move way faster because of reasons. Ow. Whatever. Come on. Bad time to reload, Aya. Come on now, girl. Hit him with that heal three. Come on. Oh, come on. I was out of that. There we are. Liberate. And that is the last skill. Liberate mitochondrial control. I will gladly show that on the next boss. Turns out it's still alive, and it charges me through the window. Luckily, I'm somehow able to cushion my fall on this thing. But it drops me right in front of. Wait for it. My body feels like it's gonna burn up. Ooh, let me get these items real quest. Ammo and medicine four. How nice! It's almost like it's about to throw me right into a boss fight or something. That's just straight. That's just basically a Digimon. That's like what uh, Skull Greymon or something like that. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I'm just straight up fighting a T Rex. Because why not? That's it. I get to also get to show off. Uh... 
Ow. I will wait so I can show off the break. Come on. No, don't you turn around. But there. Full PE. Liberate. It's just a super attack that does a crap ton of damage. Where I just go into my parasite mode. And I just deal kicks and attacks that deal a crap ton of damage to the monster. You can honestly beat the game at this point just using this attack and never firing a gun ever again. And I know it's kind of hard to see, but I'm doing 228 with each attack. And I attacked, what, seven times? In fact, let's beat this boss using just that tactic. B-Jacket. Ow, ow. And back to the CM Protector. Fire! Ow. Ow. You jerk. Come on. Hurry up, PE. I'm gonna hard commit to beating this boss with just this tactic. Ow. God, I need haste for this boss to dodge his attacks. Boom. Liberate! Honestly, also, you're only supposed to be able to do it once in a fight, but because of the PE glitch with the items, yeah. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. So, seven attack for 228 each. And yes, it sca does scale with how strong you personally are. Does it utterly trivialize the game? Yes, it does. And this gun right here is going to be our final gun for this playthrough. And here's where it was. And we can leave now, though. But this gun is something interesting. See those two shotguns? Or two uh, things? Two commands. Which means you can do a shot and then swip over, uh, slip, slip, slip over to using, I don't know, maybe a PE attack. It's, it's pretty dumb. In fact, no, it's straight up dumb. Either way, for anyone all out there watching, thank you. And I apologize for all the trouble that you had to go through getting through this. Anyway, later!